we want to find the intercepts of 2x minus 3y plus 6 equals 0, and then graph the line. Let's first determine the horizontal intercept, or x-intercept, because every point on the horizontal or x-axis has a y-coordinate of 0. To determine the horizontal intercept, or x-intercept, we set y equal to 0 and solve for x. Substituting 0 for y, we have 2x minus 3 times 0 plus 6 equals 0. Simplifying 3 times 0 is 0. The equation simplifies to 2x plus 6 equals 0. And now we solve for x. The first step is to add or subtract to isolate the variable term. To undo plus 6, we subtract 6 on both sides. Simplifying, 6 minus 6 is 0. We now have 2x equals negative 6. The last step is to multiply or divide to solve for x. To solve for x here, we divide both sides by 2. 2 divided by 2 simplifies to 1. 1 times x is x. We have x equals negative 6 divided by 2, which is negative 3. So because the horizontal intercept or x-intercept is a point, we need to give the intercept as an ordered pair. The ordered pair is negative 3 comma 0. Let's go ahead and plot this on the coordinate plane. The x-intercept is negative 3 comma 0, which is this point here. And now let's determine the vertical intercept or y-intercept. Every point on the vertical or y-intercept has an x-coordinate of 0, which is why to determine the vertical intercept or y-intercept, we set x equal to 0 and solve for y. Substituting 0 for x, we have 2 times 0 minus 3y plus 6 equals 0. Simplifying 2 times 0 is 0. The equation simplifies to negative 3y plus 6 equals 0. And now we solve for y. The first step is to subtract 6 on both sides to isolate the y term. Simplifying, 6 minus 6 is 0. We now have negative 3y equals negative 6. The last step is to multiply or divide to solve for y. To solve for y, we divide both sides by negative 3. Simplifying, negative 3 divided by itself simplifies the 1. 1 times y is y. y is equal to negative 6 divided by negative 3, which is positive 2. And therefore, the vertical intercept is the ordered pair 0, 2. Let's go ahead and plot the vertical intercept and then sketch the line. 0, 2 is here. And therefore, the graph of the line is a line passing through these two points. I hope you found this helpful.